Um, let's talk quickly about England's back row. It's the first time ever that one club has supplied the entire back row for England. Haskell making his debut, Rees and Worsley, all from Wasps playing for England today. It's a, that, for that combination, it's a big moment, isn't it? I think it's great for Haskell to come in with his two club players. Obviously, it'd be, give him confidence. I think the big battle today is for how, to see how far Tom Rees has come because he's up against a, man, a master in, uh, in Martin Williams. The side that did so well turned the tables on France. The core remains. Joe Worsley moves over to number eight in a first cap for James Haskell at six. The last game of the 2007 Six Nations is underway. And Ryan Jones drives forward for Wales. On their 10 yard line, Joe Worsley is lying on the ground. Play goes on. Haskell comes away with the ball stay safely negotiated Toby first kick tries down try for Wales what a start oh it's James Hook with the charge down and with the try Dwayne Peel waits Matthew Reese try scorer against Italy he's on his feet that's okay turn up grappily presented for Wales they've still got the ball not a penalty Go, go, go. Okay. James Haskell takes it quickly. Takes on Ryan Jones and oh, Alan Wynne Jones. Watch the feet. Flood. Cat. Offloads to Jason Robinson. Just tripped. Hands out, Red. But touch. the Welsh forwards are flying around. They'd really love to wheel this towards the touchline, towards the referee. Come on, come on, They've done it. That's an England scrum in a mess. Okay, Haskell's done well because that was awful okay, ball for a back row player. Back high most. Haskell, the newcomer. Away red! Advantage, not rolling. Penalty away. advantage, so England right back in this game. They're going to take the three points, surely he's going to have a drop goal to nothing here. Doesn't need the penalty. Seven, 15 points. To 10, 15 points to 10. Not taking the hit, there you go. Oh, there we go. Free kick for England, quickly taken. Haskell knocks Hook out the way. Out. Perry and Haskell. Tom Rees. No way through there. To Wales. That's it. A victory at last for Gareth Jenkins. James Hook wearing 10, the scorer of 22 of Wales' 27 points. The Millennium Stadium, a happy place at last in the 2007 Six Nations. No Wilkinson today for England. It's all about James Hook. It means that France are the champions on points difference so narrowly over Ireland, and it means Scotland finish at the foot of the table and England with a real curate's egg of a season for them. And I think we can now go live to Stade de France, where on the pitch at, uh, what, the, about 20 past eight in the evening it is there, all the players in their black tie suits about to go out to the function this evening. Uh, not a big crowd there. <laughs> to see Rafael Ibanez and his team receive the RBS Six Nations trophy from Sir Tom McKillop, who's the president of RBS, and also Jacques Laurent, who is the chairman of the Six Nations committee. And they won it in the most dramatic style. If you didn't see it earlier on, Ireland winning convincingly in Italy, but conceding a try in the very last seconds. And then, in the very last play of the match, France scoring a try against Scotland, which meant that they become Six Nations champions for the third time in four years.